what is good you guys welcome back to my channel we are going to do another video today so i have a good video for you because we're going to be talking about healing we're going to be talking about do i need to heal do i need to go through the steps how do i heal i got this message in my inbox the other day about someone wanting to know how do you heal and i'm going to tell you in the most simple way as possible this is the way that i've been doing it because at this point some at some point you realize if you're always trying to heal, you're always going to be in a state of trying to heal. So the best way to heal, and this is something that I do, is literally dropping the old story. All right. So healing really is dropping the old story because remember, you guys, I will link it above. But I made this video about how there are no problems to fix. It's technically about moving lifelines, moving timelines, moving and shifting into the identity of who it is that you want to be. So right now, if you are feeling that you are in need of healing or in a state of healing or in the process of healing, it's because you have chosen a state or chosen the fact that you think that you need to heal or you think that you need to overcome something and so you've placed a lot of conditions whether it is intentionally or subconsciously you've placed it in your life for you to work through but if you find yourself in a perpetual state of always healing or feeling like you're just never getting out of this scenario or if it's too hard or if it's too this it's too that listen it's really about dropping the old story and I know this is hard because the experiences that we go through feel very real they feel very like like you don't know what's going to happen or someone did hurt you bad or whatever this is and you do feel like you need to heal because it just seems like it's like wow like I'm really feeling this and we want you to acknowledge that but at the end of the day what story are you telling yourself are you telling your your story of someone who is a conqueror who is conquering their life or who is the head of their life and that doesn't need to heal but can actually choose again what it is that they want or are you coming from the state of actually feeling the need to take all these steps in order to be healed? So you're either going to choose a state of you are healed and there's nothing wrong with you. Or you're going to come from a place of I need to go through steps in order to be healed. But the thing about that is that is a state and that is a limiting belief that you have to go through certain things and certain steps in order to be healed. So there will be a series of conditions, a series of events that will help you become healed and at some point you will get there when you get tired and drop it and be like okay I feel healed enough and not to say that that state isn't bad or good but if you feel like you've been in a state because this person said that they have been healing for over five years and I'm like you just have to decide that you're healed you just have to decide because if you're constantly going through things and you're like okay you come up against the situation and the situation then that in itself has become a limiting belief for you or you have fell into a state of that is the way that it is for you when you can just choose again and I know it sounds like it may not be that simple but it really is if you stop telling yourself the old story and create a new story of how you see yourself seeing yourself as something someone that doesn't need to be healed seeing yourself as above any circumstance that is happening to you right now that is putting yourself in the place of I am before anything else because if we are one with the all then you are I am at its core so whatever you're saying I am to I am is always going to be there but healed is just what the experience that you're going through that I am is experiencing so if you are saying I am that is you and God confirming your human imagination confirming with I am healing then yes you are in a state of healing so I am is experiencing healing God itself through you is experiencing healing on the other hand, if it's I am healed and you declare I am healed and never tell this story again, or every time you go back to the story, move yourself back over to the story of I am healed, then you are in a state that I am healed. So you're just in a state of being healed. All right. So you really have to be consciously aware of the words that you are declaring. And you guys remember, I talked about it. Your two gifts. If you are lucky, not everyone in the world has it, but you do have a gift of speech and mind. If you are aware, you have the gift of speech and mind. And those are your two gifts, your imagination and your voice declaring, whether it is inner declaring or projecting out what you are declaring that you are into this world. If that is your gift.
And you need to be conscious about the words you are using and the thoughts that you are thinking because it's not necessarily just the thoughts and the words. It is what you feel behind it. It is the conviction that you feel behind it that this is the way that it is. So in order to get yourself out of that state and into the state of being healed, it is literally just never telling the story of that you have um, that you are going through healing. So instead you have said that you will say that I am healed and then you will start telling yourself of a story that someone who is healed someone who has what they want someone who is whatever you want it to be so you have to pull yourself out of a state of doing and thinking that you have to try to overcome something because either it is or it isn't but it is both the same so either you are or you are not and they're both the same there is not one that's better than the other it's just a choice all right so I want you guys to really take back your power and put it into the present moment because there is only now there is not going to be because if you are saying that you're healing you're already assuming that it's going to be a journey or it's going to take time or it's going to take however long and you're not putting a cap on it but if you are saying that I am healed and you put yourself in a state that you are healed more comes from that you start to experience the the reality of someone who feels healed and is healed and can make better decisions for themselves and this is all really just a choice but what you are thinking in the present now is the most important thing because it's not a healing like from the past or it's not really healing before you get into your future it is now so either you are and you have what it is that you want now or you are in a state of of something else that you don't have so just choose what it is you want and you have to consciously choose this every day through affirming, if that works for you, through scripting, if that works for, for you, through people who visualize or through people who assume whatever technique you use, whenever you feel yourself slipping away from or going back to feeling the need to heal, you will move yourself into the new state again and again and again and again until you get better. This is true forgiveness, is moving yourself into the state and not, you know, feeling that you have to go through all of this. It's forgiving yourself for not getting and not assuming what you want you just choose again and you choose again and you choose again and you choose again and you choose again until it hardens into fact okay all right so stop telling yourself the old story there are no problems all right I will link that video above and below for you so you guys once again I hope that this resonates with you and please Join the squad. I love to have you here as we expand our consciousness and our knowledge together. And I would like for you to share your testimonies with me. Share with me something that you've recently manifested. Get down in the comments and let me know. And once again, you guys, as always, I'm going to tell you every single video. Imagination is always on your side and I am too. Bye.